What's up everyone, how are you? Welcome back to the channel, Lee and I Gamer here in 1985, back with some more of the Royal Rumble series and Series 4 continues here and it's going to be WCW first WWE slash F Royal Rumble so we'll have uh, a load of superstars that were uh, featured in WCW or the early days of WWF and WWE um, and as you can see, I'm going to be Edge, who's featured in both. doesn't really matter. As, as long as we're both in WCW or WWE, it doesn't really matter. But anyway, this is what it's going to be. We're going to see who wins it. It's all on Legendary, and it is all at random. So I don't know when I'm going in. It could be number 1, it could be number 30, it could be number 25, 13. But anyway, and we're also going to be doing it with WCW Starcade. Uh, but thanks for watching folks, remember to subscribe to the channel, like the video and turn the notification bell on, all that helps me out. And we've hit 340 uh, subs there, which is brilliant, which is so good, which really it is like 160 off, which isn't a crazy amount. To get the 500 and you know what happens at 500, I'll be giving away a copy of this game, so make sure you're writing in whatever video you watch of me, your favourite superstar and the reason why, and I will pick a winner once we get the 500 subs. <coughs> And here is Randy Orton out first, is it? Oh, this is unlucky for Orton. But what a what a stage, what an entrance. And there he is, Randy Orton. Bit strange him walking out in the WCW arena. But it is the WCW first WWE Royal Rumble to see who wins it. It is the very best and has bragging rights. Obviously the WWE have it in real life. Especially when you come out at number one, the pressure's all over ye. And it's whether you can get up and get on with it and put 29 other men over the top rope or be in the last two and throw the last man out. But you've got to be on your best and you better keep your eye on the ball. One slip up cost you so much in this Royal Rumble. Look at the past participants not only on my channel but in real life too and Randy Orton coming into the ring now anyway let's skip on forward from Randy Orton's entrance as he's basically out there and all <coughs> who's going to be facing him out at number two Is this Big Boss Man? I just recognise it from the McMahon music. It is! Big Boss Man! You'll remember him from the Attitude Hour. Now that's where a lot of these men are from. But I've thrown in a couple of big WWE names. So I have, obviously, Randy Orton's in there. He wasn't about Attitude Hour. Like, properly established, I mean. That's why Randy Orton is in there. You've got the biggest stars from both WCW and WWE. But there's the boss man. Comes out with that Nate stick in hand. Anyway, let's skip on forward here now as he's basically in the ring. <coughs> here we go, Randy Orton and Big Boss Man starting this Royal Rumble off. Two WWE men. Lovely. DDT there. And now Randy Orton choking away at the big boss man, who sadly I don't think with us anymore. Um, another legend. And Randy Orton lovely strikes to the back here as number three is going to be coming on out here now. Is the big boss man going out? The big boss man is out! And here comes the godfather out at number three, another WWE. A uh, superstar coming on out here. And he's quite big, the Godfather. He's a very good Godfather too. Lovely scoop slam. 
And I can't believe the big boss man's out already, but he was notorious for getting beat quite early. I remember when he was destroyed by the rock in like the quickest, near enough one of the quickest matches ever. And now choking away Randy Orton here. The Godfather waiting on number four to come on out here now. Who's it going to be? It's JBL, another WWE superstar. Beautiful fall away slam. <coughs> I'm sorry folks, I still have this cough, but JBL comes in with a finisher already. But to win a Royal Rumble early here is tough to do. If you come in between them one and five, it's so tough. Oh, lovely there, that knee taken out, Godfather, and now big strikes from Randy Orton. But he gets reversed by JBL, number five is out now, and it's Macho Man, our first WCW superstar coming on out here. And it's Macho Man of the NWO coming on out. Oh, now obviously Macho Man was a WWF and superstar and things like that there, but in this he'll be representing WCW. And now we've got another superstar coming on out. It's JBL going up out. Godfather out. Randy Orton doing well against Macho Man. How good would that match have been? And who's out next? It's a giant NW. Out at number six, the giant coming on out. And the size of this man here, the giant. Just pushing Randy Orton away. Oh, and the, the giant here almost. Oh, the giant's out. The giant's out. Randy Orton puts the giant out by reversing and here's me when he missed it the first time I said it could have been a good thing in my head I was thinking you know maybe it's good he missed him because you can get put out quite quickly if you're too aggressive in this and the big show goes out on the second attempt of trying to close lane Randy Orton out here comes Eric Bischoff here now another well Eric Bischoff was the WCW owner I think Well, he definitely rivals Vince McMahon, I know that's for sure. So he must have been. But Macho Man's laying down there, taking a bit of a breather here. Is Eric Bischoff now? What's he going to do to JBL? Beautiful move there, then, two knees. Whoa, and JBL's out. Or no, who's out? Godfather's out. The Godfather is out. Nice striking from Eric Bischoff here. And here comes Kevin. Nice NW Nats. All NW men that are coming out. <coughs> And it's the big guns that are coming out. Oh, nice strike there from Nice to Randy Orton. Macho Man lifting up JBL. Oh, nice reversal there. And then Eric Bischoff taking out Macho Man. And then Macho Man reversing Bischoff here. And Randy Orton doing well against Kevin Nice. Kevin Nice reverses. Kevin Nice now. Oh, with a face buster there. Nice inverted DDT there from. Um, Oh, and here comes, uh, I call him x Pack, because I can barely pronounce that name. And what an RKO from Randy Orton. Is that, I, I can never, sex, sex, or something, I don't know. Jesus. But anyway, Randy Orton's out by Eric Bischoff. He can hit an RKO, but he has the last laugh as Randy Orton is out. Oh. Oh, and oh, Eric Bischoff is out now. Eric Bischoff is out, and Kevin Nice is out. NW man out after NW man, and this is crazy. And here comes Booker T, a big WCW man, win five WCW World Heavyweight Championships. I think he was like a 15 time tag team champion. And I, Macho Man's going to go on out. The NW are clearing this ring. I think him and Scott Hall may be the only ones left. And now, Axe Pop. And here comes Rowdy Paper, another WCW and WWF legend. <coughs> Folks, and I apologize, I am damn with this cough here. If you hear me near choke out and die, 
I apologise, but I'll still be putting these videos out for you, even if I'm in the ground. Oh, and then... Six. I, I honestly can't pronounce his name. I'm sorry, folks. I just call him X-Pac. My English is bad enough without me trying to pronounce a name like that. But anyway, here comes Sting, Mr. WCW. If Shawn Michaels was Mr. WWE, then Sting needs to be... Uh, or sorry, Shawn Michaels was Mr. WrestleMania. And Sting is obviously Mr. WCW. And look at this, JBL up against the ropes. And Sting's out now. Sting is out in the end of... Or the... The... WCW men are just getting far too aggressive here. That's the giant put out like that. Sting put out like that. Tons of men have been put out like that so far in this Royal Rumble because they're too aggressive. And here comes Billy Gunn. Thinking about it now, there's probably a load of people I have forgot to put in this, folks. But it's all randomised in terms of like... I just went in and picked people I didn't really, you know, think a crazy amount about it. So I do apologise if the superstar that you wanted to see isn't in this. As JBL, is he going to get put out by Rowdy Piper? No, and X-Pac and Billy Gunn to DX me and anyway. And here comes Scott Steiner. Scott Steiner of NWO is coming on out now. And there he is, Big Papa Pump. Oh, big backbreaker and a lovely splice there from Billy Gunn here. Nice striking from X Pac. I don't care if it's not his name, folks. Oh, and Rowdy Piper's out. Thanks to JBL. JBL is doing really well here. Oh, and Steiner moving out of the way. And here comes Gangrel out at number 15. Gangrel. And look at Papa Pump there with that military press. Oh, and Gangrel lifting up JBL. Oh, and what a move there from X Pac. And Billy Gunn just. Uh, oh, close line from hell. And Booker T's out now. <coughs> Booker T is out. Gangrel get hit. A close lane from hell, the action has been incredible, and here comes Scott Hall. I'm telling you what, I think all the NWO men are out now. I really do, in terms of either in the ring or out of the Royal Rumble all the gap. What a kick there to Gangrel. And now, Scott Hall getting beat up by Billy Gunn. And look at the strength here. Look at that, doing push-ups and everything here. Beautiful from Scott Steiner. And now Gangrel throw it. Oh, oh, and he gets reversed there. And here comes Hollywood Hogan. Look, all the NWO men are flooding out here. And look at Billy Gunn trying to put Scott Steiner out here. Will he do it? Will he do it? And I don't know. It's No, it's not going to happen for Billy Gunn. Lovely leg drop from Gangrel as Hulk Hogan. Hollywood Hogan, I should say, gets reversed by JBL in the lovely DDT there. Thankfully, I haven't come out yet, which is good. Make it a good number here in a nice strike. Oh, there's a couple of people I've missed out on here, folks, and I apologize for that. But anyway, here comes Cactus Jack. I want to see men who maybe haven't won the Royal Rumble all that much or been involved as much, so that's another big reason. A Scott Hall here now. Oh... And Gangrel's out. Gangrel is out thanks to that beautiful super kick from X Pac there. <coughs> Lovely from Billy Gunn. And Billy Gunn now grabbing Cactus Jack. Where's he going with him? Oh! And Six is out. The ready you call him is out. X Pac. Whatever his name is. And JBL now going for Cactus Jack. And so far in the ring we've got three WWE men and two uh, NWO WCW men. Cactus Jack reversing that 
Attempt to pull him out there from JBL, but he's back in the corner. Nice big shot from JBL. Oh, and Cactus Jack reversing. <coughs> Who's on out next? It's Buff Bagwell, another NW slash WCW competitor. Coming on out here. Oh, and Cactus Jack is out. What a shot there, and JBL's doing really well. JBL's going to put Billy Gunn out now, too. JBL's dumping everyone out of this Royal Rumble. He definitely wants to win a Royal Rumble. <coughs> and Buff here doing really well here. And now look at uh, Hulk Hogan beating up Scott Steiner here. And who have we got out next? We have John Cena out now at number 20. John Cena who's actually never won a Royal Rumble here on the channel. That's why I put him in this. Plus you can't have WWE without John Cena. And this is my choice folks. So even if you think I'm completely wrong, which I would agree with you as the arm about the selection, it's not like there's a specific order like imagine I was redoing like a, the 1982 Royal Rumble, you need to have everybody in there. This is just uh, for fun, so it's not like it needs to be serious. But anyway, Chris Yark who's out now at number 21, who was in both WCW and WWE and WWF. <laughs> oh, what a close lane from hell. The Hollywood Hogan from JBL. And look at this inverted suplex from John Cena. And now, Chris Yark Hogan after the carcass of Hollywood Hogan. <clears throat> look at this. Scott Steiner's out. Steiner's going home. Scott Steiner is out of here now. Lovely move, and John Cena's on fire. John Cena's someone I wouldn't mind seeing him win this. Hammer JBL, I haven't won one yet. And here comes Road Dog Jesse James from DX. Road Dog. And now Road Dog being lifted up in that military press there. Look at the strength of Buff Bagwell. Oh, and the cunning of Hollywood Hogan as he's beating up Chris Jericho here. All over Chris Jericho. Oh, and JBL as he finally going out. JBL reverses John Cena. And now Chris Jericho's on his way out. Thanks to Hollywood Hogan. Lovely scoop slam out of the ring. And it's Ric Flair out, who's been in both too. And look at the elbows here now, and JBL, JBL out, JBL reverses Hollywood Hogan. And Ric Flair, who is a former Royal Rumble winner. You've got Hogan, former Royal Rumble winner. Oh, lovely DDT from Road Dog there. Road Dog doing brilliantly. Oh, and his... Rick Flair going out now already. Oh, he's not just yet. Who is coming on out now? Who's it going to be? It's Eddie Guerrero, 97. It's a WCW version of Eddie Guerrero. The cocky, arrogant Eddie Guerrero. And now Buff Bagwell is going to be dumped out of here. Buff Bagwell's going on home. See you later. Lovely from Road Dog, And now we've got like... Free WCW man. Oh, and Eddie Guerrero's out now. I told you these WCW superstars are getting too aggressive and what a close lane from hell. From JBL to John Cena. Lovely elbow there. And who's out next? It's Kane 08. And now all the WWE men are coming on it. And lovely elbow strikes here. And then Kane comes and interrupts it here. Look at this. Oh, and Ric Flair's out now, thanks to John Cena. One 16 team world champion. Putting out another 16 team. A uh, champion of the world out. <coughs> and Kane now doing well as he's striking well. And when Kane strikes well to start off, if it's me out edge now. And finally out at number 26, can I win this? Oh no, oh no, not doing well to start off with here, yes, nice, and then a lovely backbreaker there, and is JBL going on out here, he may be, <coughs> oh and JBL's out now, Goldberg, 
Another WCW legend. And now look at this for an electric chair. Oh, and I'm taking out Goldberg. I'm trying my very best tonight. Oh, look at these headbutts here. Two row dog. Let's go. Let's go. The roll up isn't going to work in this. Matt Hogan. And, oh no. Oh no, yes, thankfully. Thankfully it didn't get put out there as I put Road Dog out now. And who's out next? It's Kurt Angle out at number 28. I'm going to go after Kurt Angle because he is tough to beat Kurt Angle, I'm telling you. Whoa, whoa. Nice. Yes, taking Kurt Angle out here now. Oh, and I missed the drop kick now. Oh no, John Cena reversing me. No way. Oh no, yes. Lovely DDT there. Who's coming on out next to what number is it? It's Jeff Hardy out at number 29. So there's room for one more. We're down to your final eight in this Royal Rumble here as Kane gets me from behind. Ah, oh, near breaks my neck here. And Kane gets reversed by Jeff Hardy there. Oh yes, doing okay here. Oh no, oh, oh no. I get myself up here now. <coughs> and who's the last man out here? It's Christian Cage. Christian Cage is out here now. Oh no, whoa, 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 Jeff Hardy beating me up here. Jeff Hardy, what are you doing, man? Oh no! No! Oh, what a shot there! <coughs> yes! Nice drop kick there! Yes! Oh, and Kurt Angle's out! Kurt Angle's out! John Cena! Bang! It's going on out of here now! And now we're down to the final seven here, folks. Maybe six if I put John Cena out here. Oh, no. Oh, no. No way. John Cena, what are you doing? No, oh, yes. And I'm trying a bit. I tried to do a double team move there with Christian Cage, but it doesn't seem to be working. And now John Cena's out. John Cena is out of here. Oh no, oh no. Who's going to win this thing, folks? Who is going to win it? Yes, and Jeff Hardy's out now down to the final five. Hogan, you're going on out now too. Hogan's out. I'm putting everybody out of this. Fucking show. Oh, I'm gonna kick the cane. Oh no. And then. Oh no, I missed it. Spear there, yes. No, oh, what a strike from Kane. No way, no way. Oh no, oh no, no. Yes, thank you. Oh no. Oh no. Christian, what are you doing? I thought we were friends, even though I attacked you first. <coughs> Lovely move there from Christian to me. And now Kane's doing well against Goldberg. Oh no. Oh, another big shot there. Oh no, big shot. More big shots. Oh, and another drop kick. No way. Can't go away, go away, can No, oh no. And Kane just hammering my chest here. I haven't done anything in a while here, to be fair. I haven't got an offensive move. I haven't got a chance to reverse on. Oh, when you don't get a chance to reverse, folks, in about 30 matches. Oh no, 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 no. 
I didn't realise I could reverse it there. I sat the controller down. No way. Oh, my God. Oh, anyway, we've got the final three. Goldberg, Kane on Christian Cage. Kane gets reversed. Kane gets reversed. And now Kane lifting up. Christian Cage. Christian Cage gets out of it here. Christian Cage hasn't lost a bit of health here now. Oh, another big chop. Big strike. And now look at this. Beautiful DDT there from Christian Cage. And now Christian Cage dragging Goldberg up. Goldberg's going out of here. WWE, you're going to win. WWE have won this Royal Rumble anyway. The last two competitors are WWE competitors. Oh, nice kick to the midsection. I might do maybe ECW at first. AEW and next, folks, let me know your uh, suggestions, what you would do. But anyway, Christian Slam and Kane back off the mat here. Oh, and then Christian can't get down the signature there that he wants to do. And now, oh, Kane reversing. Kane reversing. Ari whipping Christian into the corner. Oh, what an elbow there. Oh, and then he gets reversed again, Christian, by Kane. And now, oh, snapmer against the ropes. Beautiful drop kick. Look at this. Look at this. Lovely from Kane as he's got Christian completely stunned. And Kane now dragging Christian Cage off and Kane wins it. Kane wins the WWE. First WCW. Royal Rumble and wins it for WWE. That's a, that's a third Royal Rumble for Kane. Maybe more to be fair. Forget about the first season. But this man, Kane's done everything, the best of the best, especially on this channel here. Incredible, folks. And by the way, remember to subscribe to the channel if you've enjoyed this video, like the video, and also turn the notification bell on. And remember the competition, folks. All that will be uh, des described and, and you will be able to see the information uh, in the description. So thank you very much, folks. And I'll see you on the next one. Bye.